Hi guys, my name is Lindsay Opas. And my name is Nyashomba Gidu, otherwise known as Jonas. And we are the founders of Free Mind Sessions. Well, my journey at Free Mind is very interesting. Jonas approached me two years ago. She had this brilliant idea for this event that started off as a pilot of sorts uh, that I attended somewhere in Kangeles. And it was mainly a creative mingle. And it was a good experience. I was in charge of deco at the time and just making the place look pretty, uh, lighting, flowers, what have you. And as two years have gone, I'd say it's been a great experience and we're so happy to have had the people coming in and working with us and also for, to you who would like to join us um, on this journey. It's been phenomenal. And I'm currently the co-founder of Free Mind Sessions. And this pretty much is the engine and the body that runs the Free Mind Sessions train and we're excited to see where this journey goes. Free Mind Sessions is a, it's a community. It's a, it's a group of like and unlike minded people that come together to discuss openly and honestly different topics that we set out that encourages a conversation towards either finding solutions to getting a good connection with another person and also just socializing at the same time. An experience that's just wholesome. Jonas can tell us a little bit more about the pillars that form free minds. We have our social pillars, we have our business pillars, we have our miscellaneous pillars that now contribute to us uh, discussing about emerging issues at that moment. So whether it is um, something that could be happening in Nairobi with the, the mental health that um, is affecting the boy child and the girl child or we could be having a council culture in our society with our musicians um, you know we we want to address those issues and we make sure that free minds is is that space for you with our social you know pillar we make sure we are, whether it's your your conversations navigating between sex or relationships or mental health um, that that's essentially what social issues are addressing and then we come into our business issues which is uh, the Ashara edition, entrepreneurial skills, financial literacy, <laughs> literacy um, and basically everything you've got to do with business. We like to take things down a notch even though we are always saving the world. We like to have our open mic night, our quiz night, have a little fun, still a way to network with a lot of people um, that are like you and me and just have a good time at the end of it all. I completely feel that men and women should be equal, that men and women can do both things like cleaning and you know being able to take care of your engine. But I won't lie, I am not going to buy a cleaning product that is advertised by a man. I think a lot of the topics also depend on like the venue and vice versa. So it's a pretty much figuring out with the audience how can we um, make the, the, the environment conducive for the same topic. So whether it is your business, whether it's your um, politics, whether it's your sex edition um, or money matters, we, we, we pretty much make sure that the venue and the topic are collaborating together. And that has bred a lot of collaborations this year with Kilifi New Year, Afri Love Festival, African Novo, Nairobi Design Week, and those are people we've realized that the vision that they want and what we are thinking about have come to life in that venue. So those are very logical things. They are not, uh, they are not fun, fantasies. We so as individuals need to continuously connect with other human beings because I think we we, we hide behind our WhatsApp groups and our internet trolls and we really don't come out and, and experience life as it is because life is very short as you know and we think that you coming to free minds and being vulnerable and transparent and honest with people that meet and essentially network because you never know these are the people that in the long term will be your best friends or your colleagues or just people that you have to be free minded if you're open to collaborating with us, we're more than open to, to get you on board and see how Free Minds can help you create a conversation about what you feel is necessary to talk about. If you'd like to follow us and find out more about Free Mind Sessions, you can follow us on Instagram at freemindsessions.ke. We can follow us on Facebook at Free Mind Sessions. And Twitter 
I don't use it much, but I think Jonas knows what I'm It's free minds underscore KE. So at free minds underscore KE. Yes. And coming to you live from Free Mind Sessions, founder and co founder. Um, we are Free Mind Sessions, and don't forget to stay, to stay free minded. Mind. <laughs>